Right now, devastating wildfires continue to burn across Australia. The fires have killed dozens of people and billions of wildlife. And that's why a Wabash Valley athlete took it upon himself to help give back. News 10's Jada Huddleston has more on this fundraiser and how it all got started. Canton Terry started an online fundraiser to send help to Australia. He shares why he wanted to help give back. Canton Terry recently started a fundraiser to give back to the animals impacted by the wildfires in Australia. It was the impact of one person that helped inspire this opportunity to give back. And I grew up watching like the crocodile hunter Steve Irwin. So Australia and like the animals there have always kind of been, you know, in the back of my head. That's when Terry says he knew he had to help make a difference. He started an online t-shirt fundraiser. And when I saw the fire going on and, you know, hearing that, you know, 1.25 billion animals have died, which, you know, that's more than you know, the population in the United States. So hearing a, a number like that kind of inspired me, like, you know, I have the power to do something, so I should. It's unique because all of the money raised will go directly to help send aid to Australia. Being a student athlete at Wabash College, Terry says a simple online option was the right fit for him. I've seen a lot of fundraisers where they've been making things to send over there, like to put on like the burnt hands of the koalas. But like for me, I don't have a lot of free time, so for me, this was the best way to make a difference in the time that I have. Terry hopes others know even the smallest bit of help can make a big impact. You know, in today's society, I have the ability to affect something going on on the other side of the world pretty much instantaneous just by making a fundraiser at, and then uh, sending aid. So far, more than 200 shirts have been sold. If you're interested in buying a shirt or learning more about the fundraiser, we've linked you to more information over on our website.